moments made extraordinary. Time check. Courtesy alive by Nature's Way. Distributed by H and J Enterprises Limited. Good evening and welcome. You're watching the 7 o'clock news on CNC3. I'm Ria Rambali. I'm Ryan Beitchu. I am Jassi Marik with Sport. And I'm Colleen Hussain with your weather. Let's tell you what's making the news tonight. Authorities return to the Matura's Val Sain home after growing uncertainty over the identity of the remains found last week. One funeral for a father and his two sons killed while camping in Mayaro. Local NGOs frustrated by fake doctors claiming to cure NCDs with unsubstantiated drugs. Ahead in sport. He should be removed immediately from all positions that he holds with the Trinidad and Tobago Cricket Board. Following his resignation on the grounds of principle, a former TNT cricket selector calls for a fellow selector to be sacked. Hot temperatures set to continue this week into the weekend. I'll tell you how hot it's expected to get in tonight's weather forecast. In an unexpected turn, there are new developments in the Matura case. Less than 24 hours after two relatives were released from police custody, we understand there is now uncertainty about the identity and the gender of the body discovered at their Val Saint home last week. And as the country eagerly awaits what happens next, we learn of this bizarre twist whose body was found buried on a family compound at Butu Road in Valsain last Tuesday. The answer seemed clear, but a week later, it is not. Some police and forensic sources are indicating that there are uncertainties about the sex and in turn identity of the body found. While it was initially believed the body was that of a woman, it is now thought to be that of a man. Further tests are required to provide a definitive answer and the timeline for these tests are unknown at this time. At around 9 a.m., police arrived at the family home speaking with relatives at the compound. There were no signs of the married couple who were released from police custody yesterday. Shortly after, sniffer dogs began searching the property. Around 15 minutes later, a corporation excavator arrived on the scene to dig up the back of the yard. While CNC3 News was initially allowed to be close to the scene, police later moved us further back, blocking off the road. The digging continued for four hours, but officers at the scene and the excavator operator declined to confirm if anything was found. Joshua Simongal, CNC3 News. CNC3 News understands that police did not find anything at the home and will shed light on the investigation at a news conference tomorrow. Well, Buddy George and his sons Marcus and Jeremiah are being remembered as God-fearing and loving individuals. The three were killed by gunmen at a police, in police uniforms at a camp in Mayaru on March 11th. At their funeral service today, their sealed caskets were positioned side by side at the Pioneer Seventh-day Adventist Church. Delivering the eulogy for her father and brothers, Lauren George said, her father not only inspired and motivated others, but he was also a father figure to many people, including Dion Mendoza, who was also murdered at the camp. She recalled how hard her younger brother, Jeremiah, worked to make a better life for his family. Offering words of comfort to relatives, Pastor Donnie Balgobin advised them to put their trust in God. Well, still to come in the news, as students get one more sleep before SEA exams tomorrow, they are being told to stay calm and do their best. Meanwhile, the NPTA is confident there will be no repeat of last year's leak of the SEA exam. At Bagwan Singh Sport of Spain and Shagonas, we are committed to providing quality products for all major building projects. Let's build together with rebars and beams, VRC coils and mats, RHS and angles, roofing sheets and purlins, lumber, plywood and MDF. Bagwan Singh's building homes, building communities, building TNT for over 60 years. Bagwan Singh's Port of Spain and Shagonas, building value every day.
Caribe Hard Cider. Moments made extraordinary. As thousands of students prepare to write the secondary entrance assessment tomorrow, the education minister is reminding them that this exam is only one chapter in their academic life. In a video message to students, Dr. Nian Gatsby Dolly is encouraging SCA students to put their best foot forward. You have come a long way and you've worked hard. Go out there tomorrow and do your best. Always remember, SCA is the start of a new journey. It's not the end. Make yourself proud, make your parents proud, and make your teachers proud. God bless you. 18,248 students are expected to sit the exam tomorrow. And Education Secretary Zorisha Hackett has this message for approximately 1,000 students writing SEA in Tobago tomorrow. I want our students to remember that they are capable, prepared, and ready for this milestone. I want them to also know that their hard work and resilience have brought them to this moment, and regardless of the outcome, they are all winners in my eyes. There will be 40 SEA centers across the island. The National Parent Teacher Association is optimistic that this year's SEA exam papers will not be leaked to students. Last year, the exam was leaked while students were in class writing the exam. It was confirmed that the students' results were not compromised because they had no access to the leaked paper. Association President Walter Stewart says the Education Ministry has been following all protocols and implemented security measures to ensure there is no way, there is no repeat of what happened last year. They are putting in place mechanisms and strategies to ensure that there is no repeat of last year's leaks or there are no leaks whatsoever in this particular exam at the SEA level. I'm told that the papers or the examination papers are coming in sealed envelopes, three seals as a matter of fact, and the seals are only to be opened by the student when they come into the examination room and when the exams are about to begin. And for students who fall ill and are unable to write the exam, Stewart says they will be accommodated at a later date. Three health groups are tonight sounding an alarm to the authorities over fake medical practitioners offering dubious cures for non-communicable diseases. During a joint select committee today, Members of the Cancer Society, the Diabetes Association and the Heart Foundation urge the government to take action against these self-proclaimed medical experts as people's lives are at risk. Kimory Fletcher reports. We're often warned to be wary of fake news, but how cautious are we of fake doctors? Well, despite the implementation of the Medical Board Act, which prohibits persons without medical training from a recognized institution to call themselves a doctor, there are many people claiming to have the cure to many diseases such as heart disease, cancer, and diabetes, according to several NGOs. The Medical Board did not seem to be able to um, enforce this act. Uh, I don't know why. Um, the charlatans that are selling snake oil and claiming that they can cure and cure and cure, they have to be stopped. We see it all the time. We also see supplements being put up for recognition and for approval by Ministry of Health for Food and Drug. And when you approve them as supplements, they then go on TV and say we can cure. And that's not right. I don't know how we're still allowing this to happen. We're allowing this to be on television, allowing people to see that you could come and you could you could touch my probe for $300 and you could know how much if you have cancer or diabetes. And at the same time, I have a tablet to give you, a tonic to give you, and it's going to work. Now, this this, 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 this is nonsense. I think the state needs to be thoughtful about this. I think um, legislation needs to be enacted to, to bring these people who made these medical claims to criminal, criminal prosecution. Speaking before a joint select committee on Wednesday, the Cancer Society and the Diabetes Association said these are just some issues negatively impacting the rise of NCDs in this country. Other issues include lack of data, funds, state collaboration and equipment. Every single regional health authority. So we're talking Brandy, Sando, Tobago, Port of Spain, Northwest and North Central, all of them. And the equipment that is being cited is a mammogram. And also there's a huge delay in colonoscopies. I have patients who are waiting years, years. We need better communication with the ministry and, and be serious about it. 
is not for a photo op. Dr. LeBlanc also said the tobacco industry must also be blamed and a review of the Tobacco Control Act is needed. If our World Health Organization is saying vaping is bad, how on earth are we not making a change? The same tobacco industry is manipulating it. And therefore, they're saying, oh, don't smoke, vape. Come on now. I mean, it's being touted as something safe and fashionable, and it's wrong. Kimari Fletcher, CNC3 News. Five people are tonight homeless following a fire in South Oropuch. Corn vendor Manglauti Rambajan, her husband Dexter, and their sons Rajesh and Naresh lost all of their possessions when the fire broke out shortly before 10 o'clock. The two houses, along with equipment, tools, a boat engine, and household items were destroyed. A team from SM Jalil situated next to the homes responded while neighbors tried to extinguish the flames using a hose, but they were unsuccessful. Rambajan says the houses were reduced to ashes within a matter of minutes. That is when I walk to the back, I hear the thing cracking up and whatever. And when I tell him and he tell me that, both of us walk together. We come back in front and he said, Mala fire. And he pull our hose and start a wet and I said, I run all about calling me. You know? Her husband Dexter says they need help to get back on their feet. We don't want his clothes and mattress, no kind of thing, no food stuff. Everything, everything on, everything, everything. The firefighters have not yet ascertained the cause of the fire. As we head to this break, let's check in with Colleen to see what's coming up in the weather. Parts of southwestern Trinidad saw some welcome showers today, some pop-up afternoon showers affected mainly the southwestern areas, including we had some low-level cloud patches move across the southern half of the island. Elsewhere, mostly hot, sunny, and hazy, still with some mild concentrations of Saharan dust present. Maximum high temperatures getting up to 34 degrees in Trinidad, 32 degrees in Tobago. We we'll have the details on what else we can expect as we progress through this week into the weekend, just after the break. Fellow citizens, our constitution is a supreme law that safeguards our rights and provides rules for the functioning of government and those in authority. Serving the needs of the public and improving the quality of life of citizens begins with the country's constitution. The constitution should guarantee accountability in governance and public service efficiency to us, the people. The National Advisory Committee on Constitutional Reform wants to hear from you on possible improvements to our Constitution. Read the Constitution on the website and submit recommendations by April 15th to constitutionalreform2024.gov.dt. If you could see what the future holds, you'd see that while things change, you've still got it. You are strong, resilient, inspiring and you won't be defined by time you'll own every minute of it because you were made for more discover how alive multivitamins by nature's way help you age vibrantly you've set big goals for your future and we can help you to achieve them getting that degree you've always wanted buying your first car making it official on a truly special day, or building a home that's your own. Big or small, share your ambitions with us, and we can help make them real. Step Rising, Remax, and Dura. Unleash the power of Step Rising, where quality meets strength. Experience a longevity of Duran, built to withstand the test of time. Embrace the road with confidence on Remax tires, engineered for durability. Visit our showroom at South Haven Shopping Centre, David, where our wide range of tires are wins. Quality is not just our promise, it's our commitment to you. What if you can't make it to us? No worries. We can bring the tire shop to your doorstep. Enjoy free delivery because your convenience matters. Your time is precious and so is your vehicle. Don't compromise safety. Remember, tires are the foundation to your journey. 
Say no to cheap inferior tires. Invest wisely in the longevity and performance of your vehicle. We understand that tires are more than just rubber. They are the connection between you and the road. Worried about affordability? Fear not. We offer quality prices that won't break the bank. Because we believe everyone deserves the best. Anna Low Price Tires, your trusted partner in quality, durability, and convenience. Contact us at 366-473. Let your journey begin with tires you trust. To strengthen your immune system, you need to nourish your body with foods rich in antioxidants. Exercise regularly and build your immunity with supportive nutrients. That's why the experts at Jameson created products for immune support made with pure ingredients. For 100 years, Jameson has helped take care of you and your family. At Jameson, your wellness will always be our goal. Jameson, here for your health. It's March Madness at Standard. Get $100 cash back for every $1,000 you spend with same-day financing available. Standard, never beaten on quality and price. Meantime rules. Don't serve yourself first. Do not eat with your mouth open. Don't make noise when eating. Does not apply when enjoying KFC buckets or our new Wii Deal. Get the Wii Deal for only $34.95. He hit me. Will CG United cover this? Don't worry. Remember when I was in that competitive arm wrestling circuit? Three time champion, baby. I did feel bad crushing all those arms and dreams. So I took them all out for ice cream. And then we got crushed. Anyway, CG United handled my claims fast. That explains the arm. Best cover for the best value. CG United. Good like that. Why should one use Turmeric XL? Just because the bottle says take two a day, a lot of times the products don't have enough to benefit you, right? Turmeric XL has 45 times more active curcumin. Far more absorbable, and we could do it at such a small dose. Jimmy Abood will pay your VAT until Good Friday. Take 12.5% off any item. No exceptions at our Port of Spain and Barataria locations. From now until Good Friday, Jimmy Abood pays your VAT on any purchase. Developed during World War I, Pilates was created as a form of rehabilitation. It has evolved into a low-impact strength training exercise that is praised for its focus developing core strength. So Yannick Gray runs through a few moves for tonight's Wellness Wednesday. Wellness Wednesday, brought to you by BioStrat. Get what you need naturally. Inhale, arms forward. Exhale. Inhale, right there is good. This is Pilates, a low-impact, core-focused exercise that is popular among dancers and athletes. But don't let that dissuade you. Anyone can do it. It can always be modified to whatever body type, whatever injuries you have. Even people with uh, osteoporosis, we can modify the classes for that. A lot of people get referred to me after they're done in physio, especially with spinal issues, neck issues, and then I'll know how to cater the classes to meet that. So there really isn't any restriction at all in Pilates for anybody. While you can do a version of these moves on the mat, this machine is called a reformer, which uses a combination of tension and instability to force you to engage your transverse abdominis. These are the deep core muscles that help you stay upright. And while I can do a plank, which is known for strengthening your core, I was too afraid to execute one on the moving platform of the reformer, which really challenges those TA muscles. That said, this move was easy, and you might have noticed that I'm making small movements, but they have a big impact. Joseph Pilates was a big proponent of mind-body connection, which is important here. You're constantly being reminded to be aware of your posture and movements. It is the little adjustments that make the difference. If you want to try Pilates, there's free information online. Locally, more and more Pilates classes are opening up, and they offer both mat and reformer 
Of course, the latter is more expensive. And if you want to see more of John and his work, you can follow him on Instagram on JB Pilates. So you need Gray, CNC3 News. Wellness Wednesday, brought to you by BioStrath. Get what you need naturally. surely looks like a good way to work up a sweat or you could just stand outside because you don't even it's... need to take a walk you yeah. just go out and you know our temperatures have been really hot over the last couple of days nearing the, what we call a hot day that's 34 degrees celsius or above in trinidad 33 degrees celsius in tobago or above and those hot temperatures are set to continue let's go take a look at what's going on across the atlantic and we have winds that are about to slow down across the caribbean region specifically in the lesser antilles over the next couple of days and that will lead to warmer temperatures especially across western and urbanized parts of the country we're also seeing some low-level cloud patches to our east that could bring some very brief isolated showers but not a lot of rainfall to cool things down so that mild saharan dust present and that's keeping air quality good to moderate across the country similar air quality levels forecast for tomorrow and looking at the forecast for us overnight tonight things remain mostly settled our temperatures though getting a bit cool overnight with minimum lows between 22 to 20 25 degrees Celsius, trending warmer across in Tobago. And for tomorrow, our maximum highs in Trinidad getting up to 34 degrees Celsius under mostly sunny and hazy skies. Watching out for a stray isolated shower, but don't expect a lot of rain. For those that are looking to head to the beach to get some much needed heat relief, seas right now continue to remain slight to moderate waves between one to two meters in open waters in sheltered areas around one meter. Occasionally choppy, those winds will be subsiding through tomorrow. So that choppiness you see in sheltered areas will be subsiding as we head into the weekend. And speaking of our extended weather forecast, things remain quite hot. Maximum high temperatures between 33 and 34 degrees in Trinidad. Not a lot of rainfall. Things will get breezy again as we head through the weekend, but not a lot of heat relief in sight. All right, thank you so much, Colleen. Let's tell you what's still to come in the 7 p.m. news. We look at preparations for Eid and learn what the Holy Day means to most. With Alive Multivitamins by Nature's Way, you won't be defined by time. You'll own every minute of it. Discover how you can age vibrantly with Alive. We all want to live in a society where there's respect for the rule of law, public service efficiency, and high productivity. We each have a responsibility to help shape our constitution, which is the supreme law of the land, supporting good governance. I'm Nigel Edwards, and I urge you to submit views for constitutional reform by April 15th to constitutionalreform2024.gov.tt. It's your future, your constitution, your voice. Ramadan Kareem from Southern Food Basket. Get goat stew $22.95 per pound, beef stew $5 pounds for $99, Rabi dates $500 gram $24.95, Sultanas $8.95 per pound, extra large chana $2 pounds for $18.95, split peas $5 pounds for $17.95, cocoa 2 liter 3 for $24.95, blue waters 410 ml 5 cases for $100, Mabel's ketchup 750 ml 3 for $22.95, smart buy paper towels 4 for $17.95, Get the best for less at Southern Food Basket this Ramadan. Visit us at Coffee Street San Fernando, SS Erin Road Pinal, St. Charles Village, Princess Town, Southern Main Road, Point Fortin. Plumbing problems? Don't guess. Call Plumbing Solutions at 628-4646. Proud to be serving Trinidad and Tobago for over 20 years. We do it all. Maintenance and repairs. New construction. Sewer lines, inspection, drain cleaning, leak detection. We are licensed and insured. So call Plumbing Solutions at 628-4646. NCash is a mobile wallet that gives users the convenience of making digital payments. You can use NCash with any local debit card or credit card to pay anyone and or any business on NCash no matter who they bank with. It's as easy as scan, pay, done. Yes, I accept NCash. I accept NCash. I accept NCash. Find businesses that accept NCash with the nearby business feature. Visit NCash.com to learn more. Download the app and create your wallet today. It's as easy as scan, pay, done. 
Jimmy Aboot will pay your VAT until Good Friday. Take 12.5% off any item. No exceptions at our Port of Spain and Barataria locations. From now until Good Friday, Jimmy Aboot pays your VAT on any purchase. It's March Madness at Standard. Get $100 cash back for every $1,000 you spend with same-day financing available. Standard, never beaten on quality and price. Why should one use Turmeric XL? Just because the bottle says take two a day, a lot of times the products don't have enough to benefit you, right? Turmeric XL has 45 times more active curcumin. Far more absorbable, and we could do it at such a small dose. At CW Interiors, find the widest selection of waterproof flooring at the most affordable prices. Choose the perfect floors with the strongest wear layer and a solid, rigid core. Installed and worry-free, top trending and satisfaction assured. Take the right steps to innovative flooring. CW Interiors, making quality affordable. The 2024 dry season is upon us, and with that expectation, harsh dry conditions, and in the face of rising global temperatures, we must all do our part to conserve our water use. At the Water and Sewerage Authority, we applaud the efforts made by citizens in 2023 to conserve water and value every drop. How can you get involved? By employing simple water conservation techniques at home. Here are some tips. Close the tap when brushing your teeth and washing dishes. Use a bucket instead of a hose when washing your vehicles and driveways. Repair leaks in toilets and overflowing water tanks. Use your washing machine for full loads only. Also, use the value every drop hashtag in your social media posts showing how you conserve our precious resource. Join the movement as we value every drop. in trendy eyewear. Two complete pairs of single vision eyewear for $5.95. Upgrade to designer frames with progressive transition lenses for $15.99 or buy focus and transition lenses for $12.99. Stylish eye care that won't break the bank. Visit us at CVR. The Prime Minister tours the Trinidad Offshore Fabricators Fabrication Yard in La Brea to get a first-hand look at ongoing energy matters. Meanwhile, the project Ignite for Civil Society Organizations is seeking to collaborate with the financial sector to improve the regulatory environment for non-profit organizations. Andrea perez Dobas has more in tonight's Business Watch. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley, along with officials in the energy sector, visited Trinidad Offshore Fabricators Unlimited's fabrication yard in Library on Wednesday, where the MENTO platform is being constructed. The MENTO development is a 50-50 joint venture between BPTT and EOG Resources Trinidad Limited. BPTT's president, David Campbell, during the tour told the Prime Minister that MENTO demonstrates the importance of collaboration in unlocking TNT's energy resources. Campbell further states that the partnership between BPTT and EOG has grown since its first joint development, EMZ, in 2011. Mento will be a 12-slot manned facility located in acreage jointly licensed by BPTT and EOG off Trinidad's southeast coast. 
food scarce is expected in 2025. The project improving governance, networking and inclusivity towards empowered civil society organizations or IGNITE wants to formalize cooperation with the financial sector to assist the regulatory environment for non-profit organizations. This initiative is being implemented by the Cropper Foundation in partnership with Veni Upwan and is funded by the European Union. CEO of the Cropper Foundation, Omar Mohammed, shared details at the launch. CSOs will undertake tailored training on FATF uh, related issues and guidelines, as well as bank de risking um, issues and financial inclusion. This will culminate in the establishment of an expert civil society FATF working group. European Union Ambassador Peter Kavanesh, who was also at the event, explains why Ignite CSOs was selected for funding. And we recognize the vital role of these organizations, your organizations, in governance and development. The work addresses not only issues of respect for the rule of law, but also plays an important role in combating inequalities through advocacy and raising awareness. Mohammed and Kavanesh were speaking at the recent launch, which took place at Cape Hawk Hotel, Port of Spain. And now for a look at today's energy and forex prices. Andrea Perez, Sobas, CNC3 Business Watch. Inflation does not just affect one country, it's a global situation that citizens have been grappling with and it affects everyone from consumers to businesses and policymakers. Yeah, that's right, Ria. In an inflationary environment, rising prices inevitably reduce the purchasing power of some consumers and this erosion of income is the single biggest cost of inflation. Here's more in tonight's Money Matters. Money Matters, brought to you by Answer Bank. Inflation reduces the value of your money over time. Although $100 can buy 10 loaves of bread today, if inflation is high the next year, the same 10 loaves of bread may cost $110 as a result of a price increase. Therefore, $100 would not buy you as much as it did before. Inflation is a general increase in cost, which reduces the purchasing power of your money. Here are a few tips on how to deal with inflation. 1. Review your budget. If you don't have a budget, it's time to create one. 2. Diversify your income. Take inventory of your skills and consider if there's an opportunity to start your next side hustle. 3. Invest. Investing in financial assets such as stocks is one of the most effective hedges against inflation and it's an adverse impact on your purchasing power. 4. Pay down high interest debt. Aggressively paying off high interest debt, including personal loans, payday loans, and credit cards can help free up cash to spend on other items. 5. Consider a cashback credit card. Many cashback credit cards offer an opportunity to earn 1% or 2% on regular purchases and 5% or more on specialty purchases like travel, dining, or fuel. 6. Control discretionary spending. During periods of inflation, prioritize essential expenses and cut back on non-essential spending. Evaluate your budget and identify areas where you can reduce costs to cope with rising prices. For example, you can create a meal plan. Meal planning involves creating a schedule of what you're going to eat that week or month. 7. Speak to a financial advisor. A financial advisor can work with you to create a personalized plan for how to save and invest your money, helping you to achieve your short and long-term goals. Money Matters, brought to you by Answer Bank. All right, let's hand you over to Jassy Marik now to see what's coming up in sport. Thank you, Ryan. Here's what's coming up. Golfer Zico Coraya takes us inside the reasons for his purple patch. Stick around. We'll tee off with sport next. Things don't always go as expected. Be ready with Trinry for auto, home, business, and group life. Call us at 800 Trin or visit trinry.com today. Huge insurance premium. Pay your premiums bit by bit with FlexiPay from Trinry. For more manageable auto, home, and commercial insurance payments, call us at 800 Trin or visit trinry.com today. Trinry, premier insurance.
insurance coverage for less. Welcome to Anna No Price Industrial Tires, your destination for quality and durability on the road. Introducing our top notch tire brands, Step Rising, Grimax, and Dura. Unleash the power of Step Rising, where quality meets strength. Experience the longevity of Duran, built to withstand the test of time. Embrace the road with confidence on Grimax tires, engineered for durability. Visit our showroom at South Haven Shopping Center, David, where our wide range of tires are wins. Quality is not just our promise, it's our commitment to you. What if you can't make it to us? No worries. We can bring the tire shop to your doorstep. Enjoy free delivery because your convenience matters. Your time is precious and so is your vehicle. Don't compromise safety. Remember, tires are the foundation to your journey. Say no to cheap inferior tires. Invest wisely in the longevity and performance of your vehicle. We understand that tires are more than just rubber. They are the connection between you and the road. Worried about affordability? Fear not. We offer quality prices that won't break the bank. Because we believe everyone deserves the best. Anna Low Price Tires, your trusted partner in quality, durability, and convenience. Contact us at 366-4783. Let your journey begin with tires you trust. Step out in trendy eyewear. Two complete pairs of single vision eyewear for $5.95. Upgrade to designer frames with progressive transition lenses for $15.99 or buy focus and transition lenses for $12.99. Stylish eye care that won't break the bank. Visit us at Seaview Optical. It's March Madness at Standard. Get $100 cash back for every $1,000 you spend with same-day financing available. Standard. Never beaten on quality and price. Having water woes, Gold's Water Technology is the solution this dry season. Kelvin Ghani Enterprises introduces our range of gold pumps where reliability meets innovation. Our state-of-the-art pumps ensure uninterrupted water supply for your needs. Whether it's residential use, commercial use, with Gold's you can count on efficiency, durability and peace of mind. Choose Gold's Water Technology, the trusted solution for all your pumping needs. Available nationwide, distributed by Kelvin Ghani Enterprises Limited. Tell me about Turmeric XL. Turmeric XL, that's a new product, and I'm actually very excited about it. You have to get a lot of it to actually meet the studies. Our researchers and doctors that we have at Great Health Works for Turmeric XL, we have data on that specific dose, and it's far more bioavailable, meaning absorbable and utilized within the body. It's that much better than the expensive stuff. So you really have an amazing form of turmeric there. Turmeric XO gets yours today. When strong pain strikes, I take Panadol Ultra. That relieves fast five types of tough pain. That's when I feel my pain starting to fade and I'm going back to myself. At all. Release starts here. Attention all bakers, double spenders, and roti makers. Try our high quality bromate free, all purpose, and whole wheat flour. Low price and conveniently packaged in 2 pounds, 2 kg, 10 kg, and 25 kg bags. For wholesale and retail prices, contact Shikmisho Limited at 665 3336 or 480 or visit us at Warrenville Canopia. Shikmisho Limited, quality you can trust. Step out in trendy eyewear. Two complete pairs of single vision eyewear for $5.95. Upgrade to designer frames with progressive transition lenses for $15.99 or buy focus and transition lenses for $12.99. Stylish eye care that won't break the bank. Visit us at Seaview Optical. Did your doctor misdiagnose you? If so, a PET scan is what you need. Unlike all other scans, a PET scan detects 90% of cancers, especially where CT and MRI fail to do so and fool you and your doctor. If you have to ask, do I have cancer? A PET scan is your best option. When it comes to cancer, 
A PET scan gives the answer. Call us for a free consultation. Welcome back. It's time for Sport Now. Former Trinidad and Tobago cricketer Anil Raja is the latest member of the Trinidad and Tobago Cricket Board's inner circle to peel back the curtain on its administration. The former selector is now calling for major change at the board. On March 2nd, in a letter addressed to TTCB President Azim Basarath, Anil Raja attended his resignation as under-19 selector and chairman of the U-17 selectors. Raja said he could no longer work with the chairman of the under-19 selectors, who he alleges made false representations during the process of selecting TNT's captain for the 2023 CWI Rising Stars competitions. He, he, he told us that the person we nominated has a disciplinary matter pending and um, we wouldn't be able to go with him as the under-19 captain. And when we found out the truth, that, that was completely false information. And I thought that the Trinidad and Tobago and the 19 team suffered as a result of that. With the original nominee omitted from the squad entirely, TNT finished in the bottom two in the 50 over and three day formats and had no representation on the West Indies under 19 World Cup team. Checks revealed that no matter involving the original nominee had come to the attention of the board's disciplinary or appeals committees. Raja, a former TNT batsman, says he made his feelings on the matter known to no avail. A meeting was called by the president, Mr. Basarat, and um, the meeting itself was quite disappointing because no one from the disciplinary committee attended that meeting. And beside the under-19 selectors, the rest of the people on the, in that meeting, they were handpicked by Mr. Basarat, and um, no action was taken. Contacted for comment, the TTCB president said Raja would not be missed. We asked to serve if they, if they do want to serve, we can't force them. We have other people who could definitely fill the shoes, and um, we, have, we have gotten someone who um, doing very well so far. Senior National Assistant Coach David Williams has since taken Raja's place. Basarat had no comment on the manner in which last year's hearing was conducted, but rubbish Raja's claims. It is baseless, and I, I have no more comments to make. Despite this, Raja remains steadfast that the Under-19 Selection Committee Chairman must be dismissed. You can't do something like that at a national level, you know, and, and he should be removed immediately from all positions that he holds with the Trinidad and Tobago Cricket Board. Earlier this year, the TTCB came under the microscope for its handling of Kiswa Chaitu's revelation of a half a million missing from its coffers. Jovan Ravello, CNC3 Sport. We continue to follow that story. Now, day one of the CWI four-day match between Trinidad and Tobago and the Barbados Pride was full of surprises. The home side first looked like crumbling early at the Queen's Park Oval before swimming, swinging the momentum back in its favor. Heads is the call, tails. So... Red Force have won the toss. Sensing something in the pitch for the batters, TNT Red Force skipper Joshua De Silva would be proven wrong. Here's the first ball of the morning. And strike him on the pad and he's gone! Jason Holder with the first in an unplayable spell. He returned to get Keon Otley out for five, while Shaquille Cumberbatch got some of the action, removing Jason Mohammed with his first delivery and De Silva with his second. Oh, he gets him! First ball as well! Reeling at 27 for 4, it only got worse with a third wicket to Holder, Tion Webster gone for 11. Holder finished with 4 for 47, the pick of them Imran Khan for naught, TNT 58 for 6 at lunch. After lunch, more carnage, Shem Holder through car repair. All the while, Amu Jangu was a lone survivor, cashing in four runs here and taking this boundary to get to a personal 50 and four more much-needed runs to the team total. A 29-run stand between him and Brian Charles was broken by Cumberbatch, and then a 38-run stand with Anderson Phillip was also ended by Shem, TNT 150 for nine. With wickets dropping, Jangu went on the charge. He took three boundaries from Shem in the 50th over to race to 88, but with his 100 beckoning, the TNT innings was closed as Jaden Seals hold out. TNT 172 all out, Jangu left stranded on 93. In reply, Barbados got a 50-run opening stand between Craig Brathwaite and Zachary McCaskey, but TNT gradually clawed back. With the wickets of Brathwaite on 30, Raymond Reef on 12, McCaskey on 46, and Jomel Warrican on 6, Barbados closed day one on 99 for 4, 73 runs behind. 
Looking forward to day two. TNT's senior hockey men today suffered a defeat at the Indoor Pan American Cup, currently taking place in Canada. Following yesterday's win against the host nation, TNT tackled the USA today, and the U.S. had four different scorers on their way to a 4-3 win. It means the Calypso Stickmen must win at least one of their two matches on Thursday to advance to the semifinals. TNT will play Guyana at 3.45 p.m. and Argentina at 8.15. Hillview College returned the secondary school's basketball league's East Zone title on Tuesday, condemning Holy Cross College to the runners-up spot for a second year in a row. Hillview started well and never looked back, holding a 29-10 lead at the end of the first quarter and leading by eight points by the end of the half. Judah Tellisford, who transferred from Holy Cross College, scored 19 points for his new school. Samuel Edwards dropped 13, and Sebastian Bing scored 10. Hillview College completed a 46-28 win and advanced to the national championship, which begins tomorrow in, third play, in the third-place playoff. San Juan South Secondary edged St. George's College 51-49. Now, enjoying a real purple patch of form, Trinidad and Tobago golfer Zico Coraya is looking to build momentum in 2024. Last weekend's TNT Golf Open runner-up spoke with Caston Cupid today about the tournament and about his future in the sport. The 17th annual TNT Golf Open saw Jamaica Zandre Roy emerge as the victor, shooting four of a par 292 over four rounds. But nine shots behind was a young TNT golfer, Zico Karaya, who placed second. Going around Tobago Plantations is always going to be a hard course because of the wind. So I went there knowing that the difficulties are going to be off the tee box and certain shots. So yeah, overall it was good. After finishing third in last year's Open and winning it all in 2022, this year's performance underpinned the 19-year-old's consistency. Karaya also sealed several top five finishes in competitions at home and regionally within the last 24 months. I would like to um, lower my ranking so bigger universities and D1 universities look, have a look at me and want to sign me or offer a better skull. Offers are already rolling in, so playing his best golf would only better his chances of committing to a top program. Additionally, he is now up to his best ever world amateur ranking at 744, up from 865th before the TNT Open. We have to work every single day, go out there, put in pots, pot for hours, range work, go to the gym, eat right, all these stuff play a big part in the game and it's really up to you how bad you want it. Up next is the St. Madeline's Golf Open, where Correa also finished second last year. Caston Cupid, CNC3 Sport. Well, for our sport high tonight, we head over to the NBA. Enjoy. Maybe it's something in the water, or maybe in the Gatorade, because this week we have been seeing some monster dunks and Zion Williamson got in on the action. Yes, that's how our alley hoop should be done. It's really something in the air, and it was Williamson who went up to the rafters for this one in tonight's CNC3 Sports Eye. That's it for sport, guys. All right, thank you so much, Jassy. Let's take a break. We'll be right back. Arima Door Center, manufacturers of quality wooden panel doors, flush doors, pine doors, cedar doors, kitchen cupboard doors. Arima Door Center, located at number four Cleaver Road, Arima. Arima Door Center, made in TNT. I've definitely seen a difference in my knees, the stiffness in my hips. Because it's an oil extract, I think of it like olive oil in between my joints that are loosening it up. Omega XL has really kept us feeling great. The only thing you have to lose is the pain. As a former Miss World, I have spent many hours walking in high heels and constantly on the move. So I understand the importance of joint health. That's why I trust Omega XL. As you know, beauty works from the inside out. Meantime rules. Don't serve yourself first. Do not eat with your mouth open. Don't make noise when eating. Does not apply when enjoying KFC buckets or our new Wee Deal. Get the Wee Deal for only $34.95. 
Introducing Pentax Water Pumps. With state-of-the-art Italian engineering and over 34 years of manufacturing experience, Pentax Pumps are the epitome of quality and reliability. Rest easy with our new and improved three-year warranty and after-sale support, ensuring your satisfaction. Choose Pentax Pumps for unrivaled reputation and outstanding performance. Where there's water, there's Pentax. Lotus brings you quality ingredients to help your culinary adventures. Lotus All-Purpose Flour for all your baking needs. Lotus Baker's Flour for breads, pizzas, roti and pows. Lotus Cake Flour for lighter cakes, muffins, biscuits and pastries. Lotus Whole Wheat Flour for the health conscious wanting more fiber. Lotus Cassava and Wheat Flour, an exceptional blend of natural cassava and wheat flour adding a mild flavor to your baked goods. Create your good food moments today. Lotus, the confidence to create. Cancer, whether you have it or your doctors are looking for it, only a PET scan can give the critical details. First world countries now use PET scans instead of CT scans. Get the right scan. Get a PET scan. Call us for a free consultation. It's been five years since Paria Fuel Trading Company Limited, Paria, began its journey as a subsidiary of Trinidad Petroleum Holdings Limited. As we celebrate our five-year anniversary, we reflect on all the highs, lows, challenges, and accomplishments. Paria has contributed to the local economy through job creation, high revenue, providing a reliable supply of fuel, corporate taxes, and community programs. We are grateful for our employees, contractors, and loyal customers who have helped us reach this milestone. We are Paria, celebrating five years, the passion and energy to make a difference. With Alive Multivitamins by Nature's Way, you won't be defined by time. You'll own every minute of it. Discover how you can age vibrantly with Alive. Like shocks shaking my body. Shingles, a pain so intense it could disrupt your life even for months. Likely you already carry the virus that causes shingles. If you are 50 or older, ask your doctor about shingles. Chic Leisha Limited, the leading manufacturers of vermicelli. Now available pre-cut in parts and on parts in convenient package sizes. Whatever your needs, trust Chic Leisha Limited for quality products. Chic Leisha Limited, making your life easier. Plumbing problems? Don't guess. Call Plumbing Solutions at 6284646. Proud to be serving Trinidad and Tobago for over 20 years. We do it all. Maintenance and repairs, new construction, sewer lines, inspection, drain cleaning, leak detection. We are licensed and insured. So call Plumbing Solutions at 628-4646. Back to living with our fast-acting syrups for relief. Okay, so Skipper Kumar and all the players are on a tea and snack break. This break is brought to you by the traditional and delicious Chata Kuma. It's so crunchy and irresistible, it can knock your stunts out! Chic Leisha Limited, the leading manufacturers of vermicelli. Now available pre-cut in parts and on parts in convenient package sizes. Whatever your needs, trust Chic Leisha Limited for quality products. Chic Leisha Limited, making your life easier. OK, 
day. So Skipper Kumar and all the players are on a tea and snack break. This break is brought to you by the traditional and delicious Chata Kumar. It's so crunchy and irresistible, it can knock your stumps out. Tonight in our Ramadan feature, we speak to Mufti Mohammed Zaidur Raza, who shares aspects of Ramadan in the lead up to Eid al Fitr. Otto Carrington tells us more. Ramadan Reminder, brought to you by Sheikh Alicia, The Little Store, and Chatak. As we embark upon the holiest month of the Islamic calendar, we witness thousands of Muslims paying homage during the sacred time of Ramadan. Allah Akbar. Tonight we delved into the preparations for Eid al-Fitr with guidance from Mufti Muhammad Zaid Raza from the Makas al Ashra Jamat. What preparations do you see amongst the, for yourself or even uh, observing for, over all, all your life within Islam? Yes. What what been what sort of these preparations you see going to coming into the special day? Yeah. The day of Eid, the day of happiness, the day of joy. For those who observed fast and worked hard during the month of Ramadan. The month of Ramadan emphasizes the pivotal importance of the five pillars of Islam. In worshipping God Almighty. So that is the day of rewards and blessings. The day of Eid celebrated throughout the world, billions of Muslims celebrate, and that is the day of festive. Mufti Raza is from India and has been living in Trinidad and Tobago for the last 10 years. He compared the preparations for Eid in India to what he experiences now in Trinidad and Tobago. India and in Trinidad, Muslims, religious-wise, uh, we see same preparation they prepare moderately and they buy beautiful dresses and markets are open late night like in the last week of ramadan like whole night sometimes markets are open in cities in india tomorrow we share the iftar celebrations which is known as breaking of the fast otto carrington cnc3 news ramadan reminder brought to you by sheikh alicia the Little Store and Chatak. Taking a quick look regionally, the St. Kitts and Nevis government has announced an Easter discounted value added tax day on April 12th. Fat on goods will be reduced from 17 to 5 percent. There are, however, certain guidelines in place which prohibits the discount being applied to vehicles, guns, ammunition, cigarettes, and alcoholic beverages. The government says this initiative is aimed at providing financial relief to citizens and stimulating economic activity during the Easter season. While we aspire to be happy every day, the United Nations has designated March 20th, that is today, to be World Happiness Day. Why a specific day? According to the UN, the day should remind us of the relevance of happiness and well-being, which are all universal goals. So we asked, what makes you happy? The People Say, brought to you by Excel Health TT, the official supplement of the CPL. What makes me happy is the health of strength for my family and the, with my son excelling in everything he them. That that's that what makes me happy. Making someone laugh. Life. I'm alive. And thank God, God has kept me in good health. Food makes me happy. Life, family, friends, money. After God, because um, happiness comes, true happiness comes from him. The people say, brought to you by Excel Health TT, the official supplement of the CPL. Some lovely answers I love there. those answers. Okay, so what makes you happy, uh, Ryan? All right, seeing other people happy very much <laughs> makes me happy. <laughs> That's fantastic, Jesse. Uh, I like, I, I am happy, uh, given joy by being able to be physical, sport, being able to run around and just enjoy Active. physical activity. Yeah. yeah, that's great. Food. 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 <laughs> anyone, anyone that yeah. knows me knows I'm a foodie. I love food. What about food. you, Rick? Yeah. I would 
would say people. I think people make me very happy. My family, my friends, my nephews, <laughs> my nephews and nieces. They all do. And you guys too. Oh. And whatever makes you happy, <laughs> make sure that you keep doing it. All right, guys. So let's remind you of how you can stay connected with us on our social media platforms. There you'll find tonight's stories, the latest updates, exclusive content. And don't forget to pick up a copy of your TNT Guardian newspaper. We've come to the end of the 7 p.m. news on CNC3. Thanks for watching. And as we leave you, let's remind you all um, to all our SCAs students we would like to wish you good luck and best wishes in the exam tomorrow absolutely good luck to all the children remain calm stay focused and happy exam day guys good luck everyone